Hey guys, Kev Collects here, and it's time for another awesome, awesome doll review. And that is going to be on another one of the Movie Magic dolls from the LOL Surprise OMG Movie Magic Collection. And that is going to be Gamma Bib. So, I know we were originally like the Galaxy Girls, like Gamma Babe, Galaxy, or Galaxy Babe, I don't know. But I guess they really settled on this name, Gamma Babe, and honestly, I love it. So cool, so unique. Um... It's just fun, like yeah, like gamma, like gamma radiation, you know, Hulk, oh, Hulk smash. Um, but yeah, so, cool. All right, so, this is the front of the box, all right? So yes, it says Gamma Babe, has Gamma Babe on there, you know, 25 plus surprises, two outfits, you know, all this, collect all four, blah, blah, blah. All right, same thing as last time. On the back here is her and her two outfits one that's more kind of like i guess alien-esque and one that's more like i'm trying to think exactly what the sci-fi kind of theme is like i'm guessing this is alien this might be like fighter like space fighter type of thing not really sure and everything definitely this is like the winner for me just saying um but still pretty cool especially because this one comes out a working zipper all right at the bottom has all the characters you know the same little saying blah, blah blah and then gamma babe all right, cute, cute. All right, let's take a moment and get her open. So yeah, so originally this actually was like probably like one of the ones I was like most excited for, only because of the fact that I like love kind of like space stuff and I just love the accessories she comes with. And personally, this whole movie Magic Wave for the most part are gonna be like a little team of like heroes in my opinion like I'm gonna have them displayed and they're going to be a little like just badass team of people with abilities okay perfect all right so here is the cool little display area that we have all right so hers is cool I do like this one more than I like uh spirit queens only because this is kind of very space looking and everything still a little simple in my opinion a little simple but still something that has gives more of like an actual scene like I can pretend this is like a planet or something that she's on so that's pretty cool all right and on the floor turn it around and we have the same type of like movie theater type of styling and everything there's this time you see gamma babe on the screen all right so it's pretty cool. It says, take me to your leer, but first give me a makeover. Love that. All right, and a little cinematic thing and everything. Then here it says like hi-fi. I think it's a little different than the other one. Yeah, so it's a little different than the other box. So that's pretty cute. All right. And then here it says Gamma Babe, which this is the one part that we pull out. It's kind of the main part. All right, and then on the other side, which I think is just an easier way to get that other box out. All right. So yeah, so the other side, I am going to actually just try to get that out now, just so I'm not like wasting my time later. I still think these boxes are a little challenging to open. I don't know why. Okay. All right. Cool. All right, then she comes with a little purple chest, just like Spirit Cream came with a red one. So I'm gonna actually put this box off to the side for now. All right. So the first thing we're gonna go over is actually what's inside this little purple box. All right, so right on the front top area, you have the two scenes. All right. So you have one scene that has two of the little kind of like doll characters on it. And then the other scene, which has Galax or Gam Glamstronaut, and that's what her name is. Yeah, like Glamstronaut, so that's like pretty sick. All right, so yeah, put them over to the side. All right, then you also have a piece of her stand, which is silver, her little brush, which is kind of like a translucent purple. All right, other part. And then her wrapping paper, which is a little different, but the same kind of concept as Spirit Queen. So hers is just the shape of her glasses, and it's like pink. So that's pretty cool. All right, and then right on the inside of the box, like it was with Spirit Queens, we have kind of like the posters and the little like movie reel. All right.
All right, guys. So with the first little wrapping piece and everything like that, and her accessories that are in the purple box, let's see what we have. All right. Oh, cool. So it's going to be her 3D glasses. So hers are actually like awesome. I love this. I'm feeling very spacey, very cool, fun, different. I'm coming. <laughs> it's giving me kind of like Spider-Man vibes in a way, but more glamorous. So, cool. All right. No, but all right. Put those down for a moment. So. We're gonna go over to this box next, so the VHS box. So when I look at it, the blue says special effects, and with the red, it says leading BB. Interesting. Huh, didn't really expect that to say that. All right, so it says warning, heat or cold will damage tape. All right, two day rental. All right, new. Um, over there, it says top hit. All right, and then on the front, it said BB kind. This is science fiction fiction so this genre is gonna be the spook the cool science one and everything all right all says new all right and this one's light blue so let's open it up oh. oh i didn't realize this was tape all right ah! oh my god okay and here we have gamma babe so freaking cute i'm loving her already Love this whole space kind of get up. So fun, so funky. I'm just loving the colors and everything. So, first, I'm gonna move the doll out of the way. Right? Oh my god, her hair is so soft. All right. So, again, a good look at the inside of her display area. So, we have some wigs going on on either side. So, very spacey because she is a special effects artist. So, she's gonna be like the makeup artist of the group. Um, does all the cool things. I'm loving that wig. Oh my god, if they did that with her hair, like I would be forever like living for them. Um, even a collector doll with like real cool hair like that would be so cool. All right, but you see she has a little makeup desk and everything with all the makeup on it. You got some photos of, I guess, a little makeup idea she was going around with, which is cool. There's a little light up top. Um, yeah, just like a bunch of kind of like cool makeup things and little, like little shelves with stuff. So, so pretty cool. All right, and I love the color of this. Very fun, very fun. Right, so I'm going to put this box. I'm gonna put it over to the side because I actually like that display. I think a little bit more. Um, right. So now let's get into this. Look, look, look at that. Did you not see all that hair? Just like great. Like it's girls, guys, people, everyone. This is amazing. This well. It's soft, not like perfectly soft, but soft enough. And honestly, it's so lightweight. Like literally like just moves so freely. This is so nice. Um, but I love the color of it. Oh my God, her face makeup is so freaking pretty. It's really hard to pick a favorite with these. All right, but this is up close look at her. She has brown eyes and all kind of like cool silver and purple makeup going throughout, all right? This is awesome. This is actually all one piece thing, you know? It was like a mesh type material and then it has like this cool silver which are just very awesome like she just looks so detailed i just love this right in the garment bags hat box little magazine um and shoe box and stuff all right so let me take a moment get her all unpacked and i will be right back all right guys i am back and i have her unboxed all right and all of her accessories like just like over to the side so Again, go look at the doll out of packaging. She is absolutely stunning. Love this little two-piece kind of ensemble she has. You can actually even have her just wear this as like an outfit. So I consider like for a majority of the characters so far, at least what I'm seeing in pictures, I definitely think they have more of like three outfits. I mean, like I get there's two full outfits, but there's also like little side things that they have, like their undergarment area, like clothing can be used as things as well. Like, especially just the detail that you see on these socks. Like, dude, look at that. She looks like robe, like a robotic. Look, it says LOL. All right. So it's just, it's really cool. All right. Even her arms have this whole detail going on. All right. Up there. Love the little splotchy silver. She just looks very alien-esque. I love it. And then her hands, which are cool. I think these are the same hands that come with, um, or if not a similar hand that comes with, what you will call it. Oh my god, Fame Queen. I think. I think. I think. Yeah. 
right? But yeah, all right. Uh, the bangs are heavily gelled and everything. I think they're cute, not my favorite, but I mean like I can deal with it, especially with the rest of just how our outfit's gonna come out, but yeah, all right. I'm gonna put her down for a moment and let's get into the accessories. First thing we're gonna start with is the shoe box. So her shoe box is pretty long. I don't think the boots are necessarily that long, but I guess they didn't fit in the regular size box. Cool thing is it's actually a, a, a clear translucent blue to cover them, which is cool. All right, so it says space boots and then the secret message is outta, oh, out of this world. <laughs> Cute, I love that. All right, it's kind of hard to see, but it says out of this world there. All right, same wrapping paper. I, like seriously, I just love anything space themed. So this these this whole like thing is like really cool. Oh shoot, these are so cute. All right, so here are her cool space boots. I'm loving this. It's like a silver boot with kind of like a translucent purpley see-through kind of colors on the straps and then also on the sole. So it's pretty awesome. It's a cool kind of platform. It, the silver itself is also like a little translucent. You can tell they painted over with the silver, but still like in person looks a little see-through but it's not but so cool right love them um, this might be actually one of my favorite pairs of shoes yet all right hat box or accessory box depending on how you look at it all right so you have three different little like wrapped up baggies all right so first thing i'm gonna go over is this one here All right, cute, cute. Okay, so I guess these are supposed to be like, oh, okay, so you're supposed to go like over the boots and everything. So it's basically like a purple pleather and then has this cool kind of like spiky type type of um, detailing and a translucent black or dark gray, I don't know. I think it's more black. All right, and it comes with two of them. All right, next thing we're gonna go over is the smaller little bundle. After we tuck that one in, holy crap, all right. Oh my god, so much stuff! Whoa! Cool. Okay. Oh my god, I love like actually everything that just like popped out of this thing. Um, oh, is this not? Oh, interesting. Okay. So first things first, she has a little kind of like top piece. All right, and I guess this is kind of snaps on, kind of similar to um, Spirit Queens, but Spirit Queens is more of a softer plastic. This is just like a hard plastic, and I guess it's supposed to just like snap right into place right over her shoulders, but so cool. Love that, love that. And there's some nice engraved detailing going through out. Right, next thing is gonna are gonna be her little gauntlets, her little cuffs. Right, she comes with two of them. All right, pretty awesome. They also have some kind of cool like detailing on the sides and stuff, going all the way around. All right, that's pretty awesome. All right, you get two of those. Next thing, oh God. I love these so much. So the next thing is gonna be her little earrings. So these are supposed to be like Martian ears. Love that, and a nice chrome silver. All right, she has two of them. Can't wait to put those on. And then the final piece, which is honestly probably my favorite, is her little gun. It's so cute. It actually looks a little like hair dryer, so it's kind of like you can kind of play around with it. Like, do you want it to be a hair dryer or do you want it to be a secret gun? I mean, honestly, it could be part of her story. Like. Ooh, I'm a spy. I have like my cool gun and everything. But also, I'm your hair girl. Mm, you know that nice little blowout. <laughs> cool. So you can go to like heat ray or like heat ray. You get me? So cute. Right, and then the final little baggie. Oh, okay. So there's two things in here, which I was expecting. Yeah. All right. So. First thing are her little glasses. So kind of similar to the shape of the glasses you get. All right, but hers are just kind of like a simple black. All right. Oh, has little kind of like spikes on the side too, which is cute. Let's see. Right, but the other one, and this one is probably my favorite. I just, oh my God, this is giving me like arcade hero vibes. And that's like my favorite LOL line. She comes with this awesome like, face mask thing that has all this detail stuff in it like yo you cannot tell me this is not one of the coolest things you ever got and it's a hard plastic too all right and then it comes like a little kind of clasp you put together so it just stretches around your face this my friends is what it's about love that so much oh my god it's giving her like a real superhero vibe 
so ready to get dressed. All right. Next, we're going to go over the garment bags. I'll go over this one first. So this one. Oh my god, this is so cute in person. Oh my god. So, okay, the first thing that we're going to get is her skirt for her one outfit. So it's awesome. It's like holographic, but it's also like an oil slick type of like look throughout. Like it's so awesome. And it's like a harder plastic over like a soft plastic skirt. So you can see it kind of like you can go under and everything, but it's all one piece. That is so cute. I wish I could show you guys like the oil slickness, but you can kind of see how it kind of like gets it like that, that rainbow effect. So cute. Love this. Next garment bag. I like that, it's very Jetson. All right, so. Oh, cute, okay, okay. I need to finesse this a little bit better, but. All right, but this is gonna be the little vest piece for her. All right, so it opens like that, and I guess it goes right on her and everything. There's like little kind of like, pieces in it that are pretty cool and stuff. I don't know if mine's slightly warped or what. I gotta definitely check this out. Hopefully when I put it on and everything, it's not gonna be too much of a trouble. It just looks kind of weird, but whatever. We'll try it out. It'll be cool. Better work, cause it's like the outfit I want her in. All right. And then the last little garment bag here. It's really cool. It actually shows arcade heroes. Thank you. So, I think we have our answer. Oh, okay, so this. All right, guys. So, I just noticed I'm actually missing something. I am missing a piece of clothing. Which honestly, I'm not like too upset about necessarily, only because it's the one that I didn't really care much for to begin with. But I'm actually missing the shorts to the second outfit. Yeah, because it's definitely a separate piece of shorts because the underwear, yeah, this outfit and everything is all connected to this. But she's just come with a pair of like silver shorts. Okay, I mean, that's a little annoying. Um, I'll definitely have to watch other reviews to make sure that I'm correct but I'm pretty sure I am um I don't know I mean, it did quite pay full price for it so it is a little annoying that I didn't get a, a piece and everything I mean it's not the piece I really cared for so I'm not really gonna make a big big deal out of it but still it does suck when you're missing something when you pay full price for something when you pay for anything in general you should be getting what you pay for but whatever whatever I guess I'll also have to make do, but whatever. Okay, cute. All right, guys. So anyways, I'm gonna take a little break, get her into her first outfit, and I will be right back. All right, guys. So I have Miss Gamma Babe in her first outfit for the most part, and here she is. Oh my God. Hold on, I'm trying to think where I can hold her, okay. She is absolutely stunning. Like, look at this space goddess. Oh my god, I'm loving like everything. Like all the detail going out, going throughout this. Like the gauntlets, like she's just lit up. She's like a chromatic, she's chromatica. She is chromatica in, actually yeah, she looks like she's from the planet chromatica. Like Gaga needs to take a look at this doll and be like, yo, what's up sis? Where you been? <laughs> because I just, oh my god, I just absolutely love her. All right, even down to like the earrings, jewelry, like the earrings are so clever, so clever. And this whole kind of like coney, pointy shoulder, love it, love it. Love that little like piece right there. All right, the skirt, all the layers to it, love how it's like skin type, and then with a little flare at the top, love that little peplum. All right, even a little space in between the skirt and where those little, the gray part, the silver part starts, you see that little like purple specks, so awesome. Right. Now let me see. I'm gonna actually put her little weapon in her hand. But I guess like space is the only time you can really get like a not a weapon, but like I guess like yeah, kind of like a space gun type of thing. 
going on. Just because I know, like, guns are so, like, not really the best for children, necessarily. So I can see how, like, I mean, honestly, even for, like, a doll, for the most part, seeing a doll with, like, a weapon like that, it's cool. Alright, so based on how I think it's supposed to be worn, I think it's supposed to be worn completely over her face like that. Like, not supposed to see her lips or anything either. And look at her. She looks so cool! Oh my god, I love this. I love it, love it, love it. Like, take me to your leader. I am beautiful. I am better than you. I will kill them with my gorgeousness. Damn. Oh my god, she's my little superhero. Oh, I love her. But okay. Alright, so I'm actually gonna get her. Actually, you know what? Before I even do anything, let me just like show you guys what she looks like. At the little like space station. Oh, wait. Wrong piece. That's a uh, better, better, better. Here she is, getting ready to like fight Martians and stuff, and just look badass doing it. I love it. Very cool. Right? I mean, she's a little tall, I feel, <laughs> for the display piece and everything, but you know, whatever. So, yeah, let me take a moment. Oh, shoot! She went down. But I think that means she wants to get to her second outfit, or at least as much as we can get her into. All right, guys, so I do have Gamma Babe in pieces of what was supposed to be her second outfit. Um, oh, you know what? Let me just get her hands on real quick. But, I mean, like, I can already say I'm not necessarily a fan. I mean, like, honestly, even with the piece that I'm missing and everything added, I really don't think it would even make a difference. Um... But, I don't know, it makes it easier for me. I hate when they have two outfits that I really love because then I get very kind of just like frustrated with like what I should put her in, blah, blah. All right, so here she is. All right, so I mean the jacket. Let's start with that. Cool. All right, very kind of evil looking. I love the spikes, love the high collar, love the little kind of like coattail pieces that stick out in the back. Awesome. There's even like a high little hip little like piece here that's cute all right so her hips kind of stick out a little bit um she is supposed to be wearing a pair of shorts with this and there's not supposed to be this legging piece underneath all right it's supposed to be just a silver pair of shorts with a little like lace up i'll show you guys what i mean but as you can see there is an actual like separate piece of clothing right there and it has a little like kind of lace up front which never got just did not come at all any of my garment bags i've checked like five times already and i cannot find it and nothing flew anywhere or went anywhere so yeah i don't know a little annoying but whatever all right but i mean like aside from that then there are the little shoe pieces which they just look gaudy i never liked something like this i just always think that came off like really weird looking but yeah i don't know, it look like hooves to worse i think they're fugly ugly not about it i don't even want to really go further even into this <laughs> outfit and everything but just to show you guys here are the little glasses that come with her so they're a cute pair of glasses definitely nothing compared to the other piece before but yeah she has a little bit of like an evil dictator type of thing so this is the outfit i'd see her wear when she wants to like come take over the world the other one is the one she would wear to save it so yeah so pretty cool though still do like that you get like another option and everything especially an option and with sides you know like you have a good side and a bad side type of outfit so it's pretty awesome all right but yeah um oh and the last thing i have to go over just before we end this so lol reporter and everything this is what hers looks like so pretty cool very spacey um another scan to play so this one actually has a barcode on it the other one, i mean not barcode a little like scan thing Interesting. All right, and then her little magazine says, take me to your leader, but first give me a makeover. All right. And then on the inside and everything, it says outer 
space. Okay, later. I gotta find the order of this, put them in order and everything. Gamma Babe knows what to do. Time to beam down to LOL Spry Studios and search the pink carpet. Yeah, search the pink carpet, but first they need to fight a makeover or find a makeover or something like that. I don't know. And the other one is like walking so extra. I don't really care much about these kind of things and everything, but I guess when they're all put together, it becomes something. Maybe in the final video, I'll like see them all in order and just read it out. But yeah. But all right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry about the little mishap and everything. I mean, like, I don't know. I might have to get in touch with like MJ about that. Hopefully they can do something, even send me it. I mean, like I said, I'm not really a huge fan of the outfit anyways. Don't really care. But I mean, I don't know. It could have been a cute little extra piece. But yeah. All right. So if you like the video and everything, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe. Comment. Share. Um, I don't know. Whatever. Yeah. Even check out my Instagram, right? Nerdyboy95, which I'm putting pictures up of her next and everything. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed. Uh, see you guys next time on Kev Collects. Peace.